Hello everybody. Um, as if you've seen my Europa League review, you know it's Austrian National Day today. So I think we should look at some Austria shirts. And I actually want to look at one of the most unusual Austria shirts. But anyway, that I, I love it a lot. I'm wearing, of course, my current, the latest, youngest one from 2016. Um, if you've seen the video, I forgot to mention an important fact that I added today in the post. That if you go on my blog, there is um uh post that the austrian women in 2017 played i think of their five games they played four of the, them in this jersey and they made it to the semi-finals almost incredibly they finished ahead of germany which in women's soccer is absolutely unbelievable but yeah i'm not gonna look at this one because we have a video about this one but we're gonna look at the black one here Black is a very unusual color for Austria, but it makes a lot of sense given that our home jersey for the longest time is white with some black X and black pants. This was the away jersey for Euro 2008. And in many regards, it's one of my favorite jerseys that I have and I was wearing it a lot and it shows. Uh, just if you look here at the sizing label, there's already quite some stuff coming off. Um, I really like this template. I really like this template. The one thing um, with the you know the short collar, then this flag here in the middle is already superb. Then if you look at the Puma cats, they are actually uh, kind of 3D-ish. They are uh, really that's a big a thick plastic that's put on there, and also the crest is a double material. You have this background that's kind of sparkly. And then over that is a felt. Really, really, really nice. Nicely done. Uh, looks very high quality. It's a really nice pattern. And then you have the Puma Cat below. That's maybe the one thing I don't like, that the Puma Cat is here. So you have the two logos on one side. The number comes then here, which makes some sense. But yeah, it's maybe not the best. The other thing that is maybe not that perfect is if you see, it's a lot of black and white and red. And then we have golden sleeves. And there's actually the golden sides come with it. Uh, that I find a little bit odd. I think a red would have made more sense. Even a white would have made more sense. This one, then uh, this one I actually bought ahead of Euro 2008. And yeah, for 10 years, this has been almost my go to Austria jersey. If I, uh, I'm in a more casual setting. To say I have not really been in a stadium with this one because when I go in Austria I usually wear a red one just to you know then it's all red in the stadium so to help that but when I bought this this was still the times when I did jersey files I put my number Roland with 27 which is my favorite number and you can see already on 27 this is worn a lot so I was wearing this shirt like crazy um, unfortunately there are some usages. You also see that this is not the font that was used back then, but I actually like this one better. It's not a pretty font, but I ordered this on World Soccer Store in America. There was a time when I, for 2006 and 2008, for both tournaments, I got tickets. And, there was, and that was the time when I actually, um, I ordered the shirts in America and brought it to my friends because I could get better deals there. The printing though they said they can only approximate the printing as good as they can because they didn't have the official one in that case <sighs> looks still a little bit blocky but given this weird font that they had this is actually better although uh, this jersey had the font that i had on the italian gattuso they had actually two for the away jerseys a different font than for the home jerseys and that was actually a nice font for this one here but yeah and you can see the golden going down all the way to the bottom uh, there's also some interesting ventilation if you see here there's some ventilation here and then uh, the back is actually solid this is actually uh, sewn over the this patch where the numbers are is actually sewn over the ventilation patch so yeah this is quite interesting also there's quite some ventilation here on the sleeves so yeah uh, it's very interesting on the front is sort of solid well, let me know what you think about this jersey. I said, Austria usually plays either in red or in white, but this black jersey, as a third jersey, it would make a lot of sense. It was an away jersey, which maybe was not as cool, but overall, I think it's a really nice jersey. 
And as I said, I like that it's black. It has a little bit this color. So um, it's not immediate that it's a soccer jersey except for the number, which nowadays I regret a little bit. But yeah, I had it back then. But yeah, let me know what you think about this one. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of these. And I will talk to you soon. Bye.